What is up guys? Um, so today we're gonna do a few bottles as, or as much as we can because uh, it's off and on uh, rain through the day so I have to, I'm probably have to do this video like in different parts of the day or if I'm busy doing something and I just can't do the rest then it may be uh, in the day two which is tomorrow. So, well tomorrow's my birthday so I'll probably won't be able to do it tomorrow evening because there'll be we have a party and stuff up here so tomorrow i mean i'm glad I'm on my birthday but it's just going to be kind of challenging to get around like that so anyway we're gonna do what we can i didn't bring as much out here just in case it started out i could just bring it all in real quick i didn't bring my fan i didn't bring my lid bin out here i just brought my main equipment that thing's also got some bottles in it the last time we did bottles was June the 5th. This is three days. This is Tuesday. The cart's full. That's full. And then this will be where all they go. And we got some grand finales back here. I'm not sure if we'll get to them, but we'll try. So, um, we're going to go ahead and get the camera set up. And we're going to go ahead and get started. So, let's... Let's set it up. We're gonna video. That's that's where I'll be doing them right there, and then I'll be smashing them right there. Let's go ahead and get the first one, and go ahead and get it. I need to get my camera better condition. That ain't that ain't doing right. I'm get it like that. Okay, that's where I smash them, and then the, the impact goes over there in that area. So we'll go with that. We'll go ahead and start off with our first one. It's a 12 ounce misty bottle. I don't buy these, um, my grandmother and my uncle does, and they drank them, and uh, we buy the 16 ounce usually, but this comes from them, but I help them out and buy the 16 ounce. So uh, let's go ahead and smash this one in three, two, one. Alright, so um, I'm going to get my garbage camel quick because I throw it in there. Anyway, this lid's broken off of this one, as you can see, and the bottle is broken. The bottom's destroyed. The logo's coming off, so go ahead and take that off. And yeah, the bottom's destroyed, and then the top ain't that bad. It's made of the bottom. So let me go ahead and get my garbage can. Okay. So, yeah, my garbage can is right here. It's about full of them. I'm in the video right now, so I can't have time to take it out, empty it, and put a new bag in and all that. But, yeah, that's our first one. We got another 12 ounce. It's a Fanta. I drank it yesterday. Here it is. Here's what it looks like. Now, I think these break pretty good, as far as I know, by chance. So, let's go ahead and bust it in three... Oh, that water went right over there. That area. Seemed like it got right over on my equipment, but it didn't, thank goodness. So I had to white rinse it off. Anyway, the bottom is destroyed on this one. As you can see, bottom's destroyed. The top's good. No, lid crack right there. Can't keep it. I thought it survived, but it didn't. Yeah, the bottom's man destroyed on this one. 
I remember that first one we had. This this all came in a six pack. The first one we did broke a lot worse, and then the, this second one we did today didn't break as bad. So we got four more, and then videos will be coming later, like probably later this week or into next week. Am I getting done drinking all of them? Because um, at one time, Fancy didn't make me sick, and I had to quit drinking it for a long time. And I just got back on the drinking it this summer. And as long as I drink it easy, like to take an hour to drink 12 ounce, I think I'll be okay because that and I got affected. But so as long as I drink it easy, then I'll be good. One a day, probably. One a day. So you probably don't see two a day unless we have to skip a day due to weather or something. But see, I drank that one Fanta that Saturday, and then I did the video on it the same day, and then I did I drank the Fanta last night, and I did a video on it. Um this morning and there's some things there's some things going on so I'm going to wait a few minutes before I do another one alright we're going to go ahead and do another one real quick and then I'll show you the damage just from people walking around or if something if stuff's going on I don't like to really smash it because it could you know you never know what could happen and unfortunately these are all covering gaps in here so we just got to get them rocking and rolling so here's a covering gap let's go ahead and smash this one in three two one that was a good one All right, so get that. It's tilted a little more that way. All right, so the bottom's destroyed on this one, as you can see. Destroyed pretty good down here, right here. And then the, uh, take a look at the lid. Lid did good, just that bottom's destroyed. Let's get another cover and gap. Anyway, here's what it looks like. All of them are the same. They should buy a bigger ounce, except it's bigger. It's, it'll be the same logo about all the time. I'll just tell you that. Anyway, let's go ahead and smash this one. In three, two, one. Okay, I think that one busted because it's leaking. It just didn't impact, did it? Or no, it's, 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 I'll show you what it is. It's the lid wanting to be in and then the water flying out of it. But there ain't no crack. There we go. That's what I like. That busts. You know, the lid's not acting right. It's, it's trying to come off. Is what it is. Okay. So on this one... The bottom is destroyed. You can see the bottom's destroyed on this one. And it's all jacked up. Lid's destroyed because the lid's acting up. So you have to replace the lid. It bent and then it bent again, then it cracked. So this lid is not my favorite because it's, it's caused some water to leak out. So we hadn't been able to get the full effect. But anyway, there it is. I got five more in here. I'm ready to get these covering gaps done. I, I found out that we finally ran out and we're going to do Deer Park for a while. So we'll have them soon in the next videos. But yeah, I'm, I'm going out these covering gaps. As soon as we've done 100, just since we started doing all this, which is in May, we start doing bottles and then we're going to continue at least through September, maybe October. If I don't quit like I did last year, I'd only do it for two months and then quit last year. I shouldn't do that again. Let's see this cover and gap in three, two, one. Oh, that one shot out a lot of water. All right, so let's take a look at what happened to this one. So the, the bottom's perfectly fine. It did great. It's that top. Look at that. The top 
is severely damaged. It's starting to crack. The groove is also impacted, and I can't believe it flew out of the lid. I'm, the lid did crack a little bit. It's right there is your crack. So it did crack a little bit, so we'll just throw it away. But yeah, the groove is damaged a little bit on this one. That ain't good. Anyway, let's go ahead and get another one. We got four more in there, and I hope the next one don't have as many. I think it. I think the next drawer is mixed around a little bit. I think it's got some of both. Some covering gaps, some soft print balls. Do it, That's our first one that we've had the weed go that far today. So, this one could be our worst one so far. I'm kind of thinking it is. So, here's some logo gone. And then I'm going to show you the lid right now. It went all the way. I mean, it went, it went pretty far on this time. So, anyway, the groove is totally attached to it, which means this one can't be fixed. So, Pretty much the whole groove is on the lid. So that one can't be fixed. You can see the whole groove is gone on this one. I'm gonna try to take the dial off and I just did. The dial's good. And yeah, the, there's cracks. Like there's a crack right here on the top and then the whole groove's gone. So yeah, this one took severe damage and the bottom's destroyed. So. This may be our worst one so far. I'm not sure if we're going to say it's the worst one today because we got several more to do. We're not even near done with Cameron Gap. We've got more to do. If we even get to them. If Rainstorm don't come in and like mess it up or something. If that happens. Or if I have to, or if we have to, or if I have to go somewhere. Then I could, it, we could get back and it'd be storming. So you never know if we can get done today or not. It's just a close call today. So just, just be advised. I just want to come out here and get as much done as I can because I don't want to just not do anything and then have this opportunity to do it. And then let's say Saturday I have like 120 and I'll be out here for like four hours messing all that. I don't want to do all that. I want something else to do fun the weekends too. I mean, there's a car backing out. We're going to have to wait on them and then we'll go ahead and get started. We'll probably have time to do one more on this part. And then we'll have to do part two. All right, so let's go ahead and get another one. We got three more after this in there. Here's another one. Let's go ahead and bust it in three, two, one. Oh! Probably know where the lid went. I didn't even see that one land or anything. So I'm not, I am not sure about that. So, we'll have to look later on that one. Anyway, the dial's good on this one. The dial survived. The groove is gone and destroyed. The top is cracked bad. And the bottom is also cracked bad. So, this one did not survive at all. So, um, we're going to go on to part two because it looks like it's almost 15 minutes. So, See you on part two.